Was this horrific crash the result of someone blindly following their GPS? How awesome is GPS? A signal flies into space, gets bounced around satellites, triangulates your position on the planet, and tells you your destination is 100 feet ahead on the right. But of course, your GPS is not a divine being. Some dude programmed its software, humans make errors, the available information may not be completely up to date. Basically, if your GPS tells you to drive into the ocean, don't do it. Cops aren't 100% sure, but they think a man's misguided trust in his GPS system might have cost his wife her life in Chicago Saturday morning. Zorhar and Ifakar Hussein were driving to see relatives that morning, and investigators suspect Ifakar was following a GPS route over the Klein Avenue Bridge. Problem is, that bridge has been closed since 2009. The couple's car plunged off the bridge, fell almost 40 feet, and burst into flames. Zora, 51, burned to death. Her husband survived and is in stable condition. The accident seemed to have been completely avoidable as cops say there were barricades and signs clearly indicating the road was closed. Legal issues will likely arise. Was the husband 100% responsible? How about the GPS maker or the software writer? Did the city adequately close the road? A strange and tragic story. Your smartest, most insightful comments can win you $100 only at tomonews.net.